Hello, everyone. It's good to have you today. You're welcome to yet another episode of the Village Square series. So the Village Square series is basically um, a time where we come together and give you updates about Sendpost products, new features, and um, intimate you with the entire product um, production line and um, the features that you need to use to get results with um, the specific product you we are talking about. Today, we're going to talk about um instagram chatbot we are going to talk about instagram chatbot and instagram chatbots to me a, a, is one of one of the very exciting products that we have on uh, on, uh, on the sendpost platform okay now the um if you you know sell on instagram if you have an instagram page for your business and you request for inquiries right there on instagram and then you can make your you know you get your customer from instagram this is for you, all right? So stick around. Um, this episode or this session is going to be more hands-on. We're going to have a demo session where I will show you or I will guide you on how to test out the chatbot service and, you know, get results with it. Basically, you can go around um, using the chatbot service, um, the demo chatbot, chatbot um, app we've created, all right? All right, so to get started, I would like to introduce to you my colleague, um alexi borok i'm sure we are Hi. all uh, i'm sure we are all um we all know alexi um is someone that has been on the first um um episode of the series all right just a minute let me share my screen and we get started yes now, hey uh, okay. Go ahead. hey thank you for the invitation this is the second time um actually this is the third one we webinar that we are doing together so uh, yes. i hope that each time we'll have more and more people here and uh, they will like everything and we will keep doing this like it will be something like a podcast maybe in future who knows yes yes okay all right so um there's something if you have questions all right so if you have an instagram page you have any questions as regard instagram put it there in the comment section even after this program or after this episode, we will go through your questions and we'll reach out to you with a response. All right, so get started. We, I have my friend here, Alexi Borok. We do not have Dima with us today because he, um, for some reason he's unavoidably uh, absent today. So someone asked from the last episode, okay, who are the three musketeers on this poster? Because we are basically using the same poster every single time. So this poster is not going to change for, I think, the next you know, few months or thereabouts till we decide to find a new design. So let me introduce everyone on this, um, uh, this episode. So I am Praise. My name is Praise Ali Johnson. I am the regional editor of Central Africa. Basically, my work is to help you uh, help your business grow uh, within the, the African market. Then we have Alexi Borok. Burke is business developer, developer manager at Sendpost. All right, so he manages um, business for Sendpost platform across all region. Okay, uh, so if you visit Sendpost website, you must have seen um, a pop up box asking for like a request if you need a demo. That is Alexi. If you want to reach out to Alexi, you could just visit Sendpost.com and look for the you know the demo pop up at any time of the page, and then you you know, schedule a demo with him. You, you will be speaking with um, Alexi. Then we have um, Dimak. Um, Alexi, can you help me pronounce Dimak's name? I don't want to make a mistake. I like, my name is Alexi Borok. So let me also, I will uh, add some. So I have a sales background for more than 10 years and I work for Sendpost.com for more than th three years. Uh, and uh, as for demos, yeah, we're, we're doing them like, uh, we're making demos every day. But now we try to suggest some um, things. So we kind of we do not build strategies, but still we we'll try to find some solutions. Sometimes we uh, listen to our clients and transfer some interesting ideas to our developers. Uh, so uh, in such a case, it, it's like it's easier for us to launch new features and services. And Dima Shimin Duke, he is a product uh, um, manager. And uh, he is uh, a part of all the chatbots that were launched at Sandpulse. Thank you. 
So um, from Instagram chatbot, WhatsApp chatbot, Facebook chatbot, and Telegram chatbot, um, is Dima is the product head for all the chatbot platforms. All right. Just like um, Alexi just said, um, we are always open to suggestions from our customers that we can pass on to our developers to you know improve the service and you know give you the best solutions uh, on the market. Another thing uh, I want to mention here is that in the African markets, we are having um, a new development coming up, which is going to be a growth consultation, free growth consultation from the team uh, from the African market. So if you have a business, um, regardless of the type of business, and you are using the Sending Plus platform, you can reach out to us. In the coming weeks, if you signed up for this um, this, event, this training or this you know, event, you will send um, um, an email in the coming weeks as regards that group session. So the group session is basically some uh, an account officer will you know reach out to you, you schedule a time, we'll get to understand more about your business and prefer suggestions and consultations that will basically help you get results. All right. So the whole Nigeria is basically focused on you getting results. You do not want to spend monthly subscription on the service and you're not seeing results. So that's why we are putting this together. All right. So let's move on. Well, let's get started for, let's get into what we have for you today. So what's that? Um, Instagram. <laughs> Sorry. Instagram chatbot. So what is Instagram chatbot? Instagram chatbot is basically a messaging system that addresses human inquiries using automated responses. So Instagram chatbot works 24-7. You don't have to be online to respond to your customer, right? So it can have multiple one-on-one -on -one conversations at once. So in this scenario, you have like 10,000 people reach out to your Instagram and make inquiries. You, don't know, you do not need to have like an entire sales team on Instagram responding to your, your customers. The chatbot can do all that. Now, there is, um, uh, I tried adding that there is a, uh, an assumption or there is like a public popular opinion in Africa that um more than 80 percent of the questions asked by customers on instagram is how much is this all right basically people are trying to make sales inquiries or they see a post you post they see one of your posts on instagram and then they reach out to you and ask how much is this item that's the majority of the, about 80 percent of the questions asked by you know followers on instagram they just want to know how much it is they want the funny thing is that many businesses that use the instagram platform in nigeria yeah or in africa yeah reached out to us like they already post the price of this item on the post. For example, a bag or a shoe, there's already a price of the item, but people will still reach out to you on, on via DM and asking you what, how much is it. Do you not understand why that's, why people behave that way, but people do that. So the Instagram chatbot can help you to automate that kind of conversations and make you focus on what matters the most to you, collecting money and shipping out your items. All right, so Send Pulse is an official um, partner for the Meta um platform so an official partner on the meta platform simply means that um you you have um direct access via send calls to connect to any of the meta platforms so what is meta we all know facebook all right so facebook is not just a social media platform facebook has grown to be um a conglomerate of multiple or a group company with multiple um, apps so facebook owns you know the instagram platforms facebook owns um the facebook platform Facebook changed their name from Facebook to Meta. So now Meta owns Facebook, which is the normal Facebook app you, um, you are used to. Facebook, Meta owns Instagram, Meta owns WhatsApp, and an array of other products. So you cannot connect to WhatsApp, for example, you cannot connect to Instagram without Meta. So SendPost being a Meta official connection partner simply means that you don't have any problem connecting to the um, um, Instagram chatbot. You will not get, you know, you don't have to go through the stress of learning how to code, building up the system, the APS and all that. It's just basically you sign up, you, uh, you fill a few forms and you could get connected. All right. So some of the things we've done, all right. One of the things we've done that I'm very, very passionate about is the payment integration for um, the chatbot, the payment integration for the chatbot. Um, the chat so so send posts um give you access to multiple services including paypal stripe and Flutter. now Flutterwave wave is very important because if you're in the african market 
you have and you use Flutterwave or you you want to use Flutterwave, you'll be able to receive payments from different platforms. Just a minute, let's me. Um, all right, before the end of my of this presentation, my presentation, I will drop a link where you can test out the demo. If I can't do that, I will be able to send that uh, in the course of the conversation um, with uh, in the course of um, Alexis' conversation. So let's keep going. So send plus plus Instagram plus payment integration is is equals to you know growth. It equals to um, tremendous sales. All right. So in this scenario, you are you, maybe a small business owner. You use Instagram for your sales. You reach out to customers, customers reach out to you and make inquiries. You can only deal with a customer at a time. And then you want to hire multiple staff to be able to deal with customers on the Instagram platform. But with the payment integration feature, which is the, one of the biggest features we have, or one of the biggest features so far on any chatbot platform, is that you can conclude a conversation and make an asset payment from a customer without even having to get engaged in that conversation. All right? So customers do not need to ask you for discount you only engage with customers that eventually pay. So if you drive a traffic of a thousand people to your Instagram page, people reach out to you, they want to make payments. You eliminate yourself from that stress, the mental stress, the anxiety. Oh, is this person going to pay? Is this person not going to pay? You only focus your attention on those who eventually make a payment and then they need your item. And your job will just be either provide a service, either ship up, ship, ship up the item or provide a consultation service if you are using a platform for consultation. All right, so what is Flutterwave? Um, I'm not going to talk about PayPal or Stripe because um, you can, you know, basically in your spare time, you can learn about that. And PayPal, everyone knows PayPal. But Flutterwave is one platform available to all Africans. Now, I'm aware that PayPal is not available to some countries in Africa. So that's why we're going to talk about Flutterwave. With Flutterwave, you can accept payments from every country in Africa, Morocco, Nigeria, Ghana, Egypt, South Africa, Uganda, Kenya, regardless of where you are in Africa, you can actually set up a PayPal, I mean, Flutterwave account. So what is Flutterwave? Flutterwave is basically like PayPal. Flutterwave is a financial service company that just like Stripe and PayPal that provides a payment infrastructure for global merchants and payment service providers across the continent. All right. So basically, you can accept payment from anywhere, any, any from anyone, anywhere in the world from your Instagram chatbot. So why do we choose Flutterwave? So the cost of transaction is the cheapest. Um, if you use some other platform, you will see that they charge you up to 3% 3, 3 per transaction. They charge you maybe 2% um, plus an extra fixed fee. But with the Flutterwave platform, it's a very uh, flat fee. So it's 1.4%, 1.4, 1.5% per transaction. So that should keep most of your money. So the cost of transfer, the cost of payment is very low. Also, the reason, another reason why we choose Flutterwave is that you have numerous ways to pay. So your customers can reach out to you, see your items on your chatbot, and then decide to pay. And they don't need to decide, oh, should I use my card? Or should I use, you know, they can use anything. You can use card, you can use bank transfers. This, this all depends on the country you are, you are from. So you can use um, M-Pesa. If you're in Kenya, you can use M-Pesa. You can use Apple Pay. You can use Google Pay. Just imagine that. So your customers do not have limits to accepting payment from your customers, right? So you do not have limits from accepting payment from your customers. There is no such thing as, oh, let me do a transfer, send me your account number. No. If they want to do a transfer, they can do that on the, pla on the platform within the chatbot. Another exciting thing is that you do not need to leave Instagram to conclude a transaction. Right. Your customer doesn't have to reach out to you, ask for an account number. You don't have to use payment links. You don't have to do all those things. All right. And you also, you don't have to verify transactions. The moment your customer comes to your chatbot, you've gone through the conversations. The customer has chosen to make a purchase from you, and they've gone ahead and make a purchase all within your Instagram chat um, DM. They can actually pay. And once they pay, they receive a verification or a confirmation of payment all within the same DM. All right. They will receive... Two things they receive. They receive email confirmation. So they will enter their email address and they receive an email confirmation that the payment has been made. You also, the business owner or the Instagram page owner, you also receive payment confirmation that someone has, you know, paid for the item. And also, um, you you will now receive confirmation within the chatbot, or there will be a confirmation box within the chatbot. And also, the business owner 
we also, which is you, also receive paper confirmation within the chatbot. So there's transparency. There is no such thing as fake transfers. Fake transfer is one of the biggest issues in Africa, where people reach out to you as a vendor, ask to make payments, and then send you a you know screenshot of a payment. I've made payment. Please send me my item. But you know you are trying to sell. You end up sending the item. You get into trouble with your customers. You realize that you've gotten you've gotten scammed. No such thing as that, right? So that's why you see them quite excited about the Instagram chatbot because people are actually getting results with it. People are actually using it to sell on Instagram. And um, so aside from Flutterwave, you can use PayPal and other payment methods. Um, the demo isn't showing up. So what I will do is that I will give the stage to Alexi. And while he's talking about maybe at the end of his conversation with you guys, I will drop the link to the demo. All right, so Alexi, the stage is yours. Okay, thank you. Hold on. Okay, do you see my screen? Uh, let me see. Yes, I think. No, not yet. Okay, hold on. Okay, now it is here, right? Yeah, type something in the comments just to let me know if uh, you see my presentation now. Um, let me see. I think I can see it from here. If you can see Alexis' presentation, type something in the comments. And if you have question, uh, this is the time to put it in the comments, um, in the comment section. Hi. Hi. So uh, as far as I understand, uh, now the people can see it. So first of all, I want to talk about like what we can do with chatbots, like what goals we can to uh, like uh, we can achieve what like how how to use it why do we need it because many people heard about chatbots many people uh like thought like maybe this is the solution that i need but they still have some doubts so let's talk about like how to how to why you need to create it and how to do that so first of all you can collect leads with your chatbot so not all people think about um, this idea like because we have a uh, sign up widgets you can have a qr code that will redirect the person from somewhere to your chatbots you can even print it on uh, some posters like whenever you want like on the landing page and so the person can simply scan it activate your chatbot or trigger your chatbot and after that the person becomes your subscriber and after that as a result you will be able to target that person with some um, uh, with uh, some other information like discounts, updates, uh, anything you want. And uh, of course, you can use the direct link connected somewhere on the website, like create a button. It can be our sign up widget, it can be a button created in HTML uh, and CSS, and, and uh, you can connect it with uh, that button, and the person clicks. And uh, the same thing, trigger your chatbot, becomes your subscriber. Actually, um, I will not talk about this like uh, during our today's webinar, but want to make a threat that uh, soon on, in all countries will be available our new service uh, pop-up messages. So it's like something like uh, sign up widget, but it's more advanced thing. When uh, messages appear on the website, whenever you want, there are many triggers that can uh, trigger those uh, pop-up messages. And uh, the person also can subscribe uh, to your social, uh, actually to a chat bot, for instance, Instagram. So of course you can create an automated flow with a chat bot. So it, it, as you understand, it's like, a, it can be a support flow, sales, sales flow. It can be quiz, like menu, anything you want. Like this is something that can be done when um, automatically when you can't uh, reply, when you aren't able to reply to a client. Uh, and of course you can send like weekly newsletters, updates, discounts, 
Uh, usually I make a stress that we have three options. Actually, I will talk a little bit later about like three ways of on how to communicate with your uh, client. Um, so, of course, uh, as Praise mentioned several times that we have, uh, you are able to accept payments or donations. So this is a new thing. You are able to receive not fixed payments, but donations. If you aren't in sales, but in other businesses, it's possible to just give the person the link and the person will uh, donate that um, amount that uh, that person feels reasonable to pay like um, so this is really important update so and of course you can manage all the deals created um, thank you for the question we'll reply in the end uh, so uh, and you can manage all those deals in our CRM system so all those deals that created uh, in your chatbots, like in Instagram, WhatsApp, or other messengers, uh, messengers, and uh, like landing pages, anywhere in your Saint Paul's account, they will reflect in your Saint Paul CRM, which is currently free. And uh, like, of course, you can manage your chatbots on your mobile. Um, the re the thing that I didn't mention here, this is really important. Like. When you create a chatbot and use send pulse, you can have many managers, many representatives who work under one account. You can invite users, simply click on user set, also like uh, account settings, invite user and give an access to your account. So it's much more comfortable than uh, type from your desktop version or your mobile. And it's difficult to have like several employees who can uh, communicate with your clients instead of you so this is like really important to understand so okay um, so now we need to understand how to connect what we need to start using the chatbots or to how to connect it so first of all you need to have not just one uh, not just one uh, instagram profile but two and uh, one um should be like a business account so uh type who knows like uh what is business account like instagram business account if you don't um usually it's uh, you can switch that uh, when you open your settings and uh, when you open open your settings and um there will be a button switch to business account that is all really simple so on my personal uh, now opinion like uh, to create um using your mobile version it will be like more the more like it's it's really simple uh, i suggest you to use mobile version to create uh, your uh, instagram chatbot so first of all you need to connect your um, instagram business account with your facebook profile page or sorry like brands facebook page and after that um you will be able to add your Instagram business account to send connected with your samples account and after that um, in the end of uh, this uh, like um, this the latest like after that you need to connect another like the second uh, Instagram page it will be something like a test page for you so if you send the test message you will be able just to send it to check how it looks like for instance this is uh, on this like the screenshot you see um how my chatbot looks when somebody uh, like initiated the conversation so i didn't build a sequence or a flow so this is how it looks like just a simple welcome message so there are actually two main ways on how to um link your facebook page with uh, your instagram business account actually uh, both ways are really simple so can you can connect instagram with your facebook or instagram so or vice versa like it's up to you you can use like so on my, on my on my personal opinion it's better to use mobile version of course and uh what's important sometimes people um they switch accounts like from business account to just uh, like ordinary personal account account uh, sometimes they from time to time connect in something with something and meta platform like when you try to use all these 
you know, when you try to use all these like uh, meta platforms, it's a little bit more complicated sometimes for an unexperienced user. And um, we have some guides how to reset all the all the settings uh, before can start it before you start connecting your uh, Instagram business account or a Facebook page. And um, if uh, something unclear after we finish the demo, just let us know. We will send you those guides. And uh, don't forget, like we actually uh, we have a technical support team to work 24 hours per seven days. We have prized uh, myself. And we can um, guide you. So uh, actually, it is not a problem if even something goes wrong. Okay, so let's move on. And uh, after the chatbot is created, this is how it looks like on mobile and uh, on desktop. Like on the uh, on the left, you can see the uh, your personal Saint Paul's account. So like the structure is almost the same in each chatbot that we have. Like in what for? Um, I mean, chatbots for WhatsApp, for Facebook Messenger, for Instagram, or for Telegram. So uh, the structure is almost the same. Like audience tab, statistics tab, like flow. Um, for for like to those who has the an account, like it's uh, it looks. Uh, from, like it doesn't look uh, very different in the this is how uh, my chatbot looks like on the right you can see it you can subscribe and follow it's like and um, uh, there are actually three main as I mentioned before there are um, three main ways on how to communicate with your client okay uh, before I start start I want to uh, show you like how the widgets look like so you can uh, place it whenever you want, somewhere on the top, on the button, or sorry, on the like. It can be like a floating, uh, like pop-up message, and it can be just one, like Instagram chatbots, or you can connect other ch channels as well. So um, usually, I say that Saint Paul's be becomes really powerful when the, when you try to combine all these tools and all those all messengers. I know that it is not reasonable for all the businesses, and um, but in, for some, it, it is really so. And uh, mm, as we talk about pricing plans, um, when you paid once, like you actually can start um, using like not just Instagram, but also Facebook Messenger chatbot and Telegram as well. Just um, WhatsApp, they have some additional fees. We uh, had this in our previous Village Square series episode. Uh, so you can watch it in the, the recording. It's available. Um, but in any case, if you paid once, if you are a paid client, uh, you can uh, use all these um buttons and I suggest sorry like widgets and uh, and you I suggest you to cross this platform like uh, you can send the message using your WhatsApp uh, and uh, ask to subscribe or invite the person to subscribe to your Instagram uh, Facebook Instagram page that is how it works so um, my um, usually I say that there are three main ways on how how to communicate with your clients so you on the uh, in the top right corner, you can see how the simple or single campaign looks like. Um, you can send like updates, uh, digest, weekly newsletters, discounts, anything like that. Usually it's buttons or button or several buttons, image or several images and text. Mm. And you can, you can schedule this message and send it. After, this is how it works. Uh, option number two. Um, this is uh, an automated flow. This is the chatbot itself. When you create a sequence of messages um, that can be triggered by different actions, it, it works according to your client's behavior, like uh, what they click, what they prefer. You can ask questions. The person needs to select the right answer. According on, on that, you can segmentate the database, use segmentation, assign specific tags, create custom var like variables. Uh, they are after that they reflect in your 
audience tab in your next sim like simple campaigns for instance you can use that data and uh, um, target very specific audience because uh, after some questions you can know you will know like where those recipients live maybe you know their location like gender age anything you can ask them to uh, provide you with some data like emails or phone numbers if you have emails you um after that uh, they become your subscribers and you're able to target with that audience with emails or with the text messages or maybe um, you will be able to start using whatsapp maybe you decide to apply for whatsapp business api solution as well so today of course uh, we talk about instagram chatbots so just so you know this uh, like this option is exists okay uh and the option number three um chat in real time uh especially uh, when you have uh, technical support that use instagram chatbots um or maybe a sales flow but from time to time you need um, um you have some stages maybe where you need to pause the flow and you need the real person to be a part of the conversation with your representative so this is how it works if you have several chatbots you need simply to select the the one you need and start uh, texting you will see um in the center on the screen you will see the customer journey what they clicked what they did what uh, actually they're interested in sometimes if the person stuck you can simply text something like hey i saw that you triggered the chatbots but didn't find uh, the solution you stopped clicking that is why i want to um in like uh, for instance you can if you can simply send the phone number and the person will call you like in any case you you will continue the communication in in in, uh, in another way using another communication channel so okay let's move on so as i mentioned before all the deals all people who paid um all those deals will reflect in our CRM system. Uh, our CRM system for now, uh, it's one of our core projects. We soon, we believe that this is, will be like a really advanced tool. Um, for now, it's also like a great CRM system, but we have many ideas. We have many features to be added in the future. So that is why I'm saying like, it, like so this is like not the final result so i know that it's now it's also like it's good it i suggest you to start using it but we have many things that we want to add and the soon like we expect that our crm will be like really really advanced thing so as you see on my screenshot that uh, there are can be several pipelines as an example i created a few like a two a customer success and sales team you are able to drag the deals um, simply if somebody paid you can do that manually you can you can assign person to specific pipeline and you can connect specific pipeline with your chatbot so each time when the person buys that the, that um, amount um, will reflect in your crm system and the responsible person can contact that um, client and ask like hey um where this product needs to be delivered or please um provide us with some additional information that we will um send you the package so i don't know it, it, it's it's up to you from time actually on your side it's uh, a bit more understandable how to use uh this thing because you understand your strategy you know your buyers persona like who are your clients uh what they want so on your side sometimes it's more um understandable how to build this communication and how to use the chatbot but um what i'm trying to say that um this is a great solution for you so when you're um, thinking about thinking about instagram chatbot so think wider think about crm system think about other communication channels like email marketing or maybe other chatbots like whatsapp telegram or facebook messenger 
Okay. So, of course, yeah, I saw that there is a question about mobile applications. So, sure, you are able to manage your chatbots on your mobile. It is not a problem. It can be done. And uh, I want to talk about latest updates. So, soon, like in a few days, maybe in a week, um, reactions will be available. And um, the latest, actually, the most like visible thing that uh, you can see when you open the chatbot tab that now we have donations. I talked about that. This is like extremely important for some businesses or maybe for um, non-profit uh, organizations. So this is how uh, it works. Um, I suggest you to use this option as well. So in the um, soon, this is maybe in a weeks, uh, maybe two weeks, three weeks. We expect that um, it will become possible to copy flows um, created for other me me like meta platform for WhatsApp or Facebook Messenger. So it can be soon. I know that many our users are waiting for these updates, uh, for this update, uh, and especially for the like for um, this. Um, update number three and uh there is one more thing that i want to talk about hold on so uh, uh the, what, i want to make a stress on one thing that is different in instagram chatbot so uh, when some like with for instance we don't have such uh things in uh chatbots for facebook messenger for whatsapp for telegram um, you can automatically reply when somebody tagged, like, um, uh, like uh, posted in stories something about your company, like about this travel blog, for instance. So you can create an automatic reply. When uh, you posted the stories and somebody reacts, you can do the, the same. Like, uh, this is really... Uh, like this thing that is completely different from we don't have something in uh whatsapp or facebook messenger chatbot something like this and um okay so um i think that we need to look at our comments and our sec um uh, and our questions okay before we go into questions um, okay before we go into questions uh uh, while you were talking, I was able to quickly create a chatbot, create a flow. I had a payment integration and I will share the demo link to everyone. So basically it tells you that it's pretty much straightforward and easy to use. You do not have you know, to do too much to get it set up. So let me share my screen real quick. All right, so um, before, so I would, let me just drop the link. So here is the chatbot link, all right? And let me drop the link in the comment section as well. Um, where is that? Um, chatbot. Okay, here is the demo. So this chatbot is basically for, um, I use an idea of um, um, someone that sells a bag, that sells bag online. So basically, click the link that I just dropped in the comment section, um, or you can use the link from the screen. And then once you go with this link, or just find sendpost.demo on Instagram and you know send them a message. So to test it out, the very easy way to test it out is to say hello. Right? So once you say hello, it brings out um, options for you to... It brings up the option for you to choose if you want to... Um, you know, see the products available or um, make an inquiry. So click on products and that way you can, you know, see all the products available. Right here, I added just three products. Uh, mind you, here, here is the, the interface, conversation interface where you're going to be talking to your customer, all right? You can do this from here. You can do, you can talk to your customer from this conversation interface. All your staff, if you have like 20 staff, 1,000 staff can do all that from here. You can do the same from the Send Pulse um, chatbot app, just like Alexis showed you earlier. The Send Pulse chatbot app is available on the App Store and the Google Play Store. 
And you can even decide to chat customers directly on your Instagram naturally, the way you are used to it. So here I added three different bags. And this customer basically clicked on explore bag. So you see this welcome. Um, and then you have these two options for to explore our bags or delivery supports. Then you explore the bag and then you make payment. So basically this person picked the black Gucci bag, which is this one, and then they made a payment and then the payment is successful. You could see this status completed here, right? So you receive this status completed as a business person, your customer will also receive status completed. Also your customer will receive an email confirming, confirming the, the, the payment successful. Then you could see the icon that this payment is made via Flutter wave. All right. So if you want to test it out, um, the account is currently in test mode. So um, you'll be using um, test accounts. So let me just drop this also for where you can get test um, bank details or test cards to test it out. So, because I'm sure you don't want to use your real you know, card or your real payment. Um, so you can use test cards here. And um, yeah, you, I basically used any of the options available right here. I used um, this option. So you can use any of these test cards to run or to test the transaction. You will see how it goes. Um, to get the better, um, a better um, idea of how it works, always use it like an email address you have, right? So that you will receive the confirmation of the payment and you understand how it works. Also, another thing a customer asked um, that I wanted to show before we go into the questions is, um, it's to set up Flutter, we're just going to flutter.com and, you know, sign up. All right. So here also is the, on the SendPost account, is the payments um, section or the payments um, integration section where you can add all payment options. You can see we have all these payment options. And right here, you can see the received uh, recent payments. And you can see the payments you received today, which is the 27th, which is just 2,000 era by Flutterwave. So you can see all these payments and then you can also receive the same analytics of payments on your Flutter Wave account. Also, just like Alexi mentioned, I just want to stress a few other things. So on this um, chatbot setups page, right, or the chatbots um, um, account page, there are a few things you can do that, you know, is very, you know, it's of tremendous benefit to your business story mentions all right so basically someone mentioned your name your brand and your story so if for example we have someone here that's like a digital creator you want to do giveaways or you want your customers to engage with you and you don't want to do that by staying on your phone you can actually use the story mentions. so if someone mentioned you know you could say i'm giving away free consultations i'm giving away free whatever just post this stuff a video of yourself talking about you know why you should be a part of the program and mention, you know, your brand name, your Instagram, um, um, your Instagram, what I call it, your Instagram handle. Once they mention Instagram handle, right, you can trigger a message that gets sent to them. So you can say, hey, welcome to whatever, and you can, you know, have a conversation with them directly from the mentions. Another good thing is you can do that also from comments. So if a customer comments on your post, you can automatically send them a, a DM. You can automatically send them um, a, a message, okay? Basically, you're engaging with your customers. Another thing is if you are doing Facebook, um, Instagram Live, all right, you're doing Instagram Live, you're asking customers to do a thing or two. The moment they mention your brand or they engage with your Instagram Live, you can automatically send them a response. So you can see all that. It's just beyond, it's not, it's, it's beyond just, you know, chatbot. There's a lot you can do with it. You can automate literally almost everything on your Instagram from this. And also, you can accept payments. All right, so there's a customer that uh, is experimenting with selling products on Instagram Live, right? So she wants to Instagram Live where she shows a product, shows the you know, samples and all that, and people can buy directly from the live. So you can do that. People can buy from your live. You can, you know, you can accept payments and you can, you know, receive payment confirmations. And you can even mention, hey, thank you so, 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 and so for, you know, buying this item. Thank you for buying this item. And you can engage, it's the, like the... The creativity is, you know, endless. You can find more creative ways to engage with the chatbot. All right, so please try out the chatbot and, you know, let me know how it goes. So now to questions. So we have a few questions um, sent while um, people uh, registered. And so 
we will first go with the questions we have on the live and then we'll go into other questions all right so um alexi you can see the questions right yeah yeah i can see so that's that i would also like to talk about pricing plans if you never mind oh yeah i just remember that we didn't mention that yeah this so is pricing uh, I can share the screen. Do you see it? Oh, I'm, I need to stop sharing. Okay, go ahead. Do you see my screen? Not yet. Okay, hold on. Okay, now. Not yet, let's see. Not yet. Okay, now. Yeah, so all the pricing plans based on the number of your subscribers in total. So let's say you have several chatbots, so you need to calculate all uh, their subscribers. Actually, the system will do that instead of you. And um, as you see with our free plan, you can have uh, two up to three chatbots created and um, you can have um, uh, 1,000 of subscribers, you can send to up to like uh, 10,000 messages per month. Of course, uh, there is an option to, you can use like uh, create custom variables as well and use RSS um, option and API as well. So uh, the only thing that if you are going to apply for WhatsApp business API solution, so uh, in such a case, you need to watch our previous episode about what's our business API solution. Yeah. Uh, okay. And uh, yeah, so this is how it works. And of course, I want to make a stress on annual discount. So for, if you have a, if you need to plan a like annual budget, you can do that according to this and uh, calculate the cheaper price. And um, yeah, so don't forget about annual discount this is that is all that i wanted to say about pricing plans okay great one other important thing that i think is to make we should mention uh, um, about pricing is the fact that if you go for an annual plan all right good thing black friday is coming so you can get a higher discount but if you go for an annual plan and um the question is, if I go for an annual plan for 1,000 subscribers, what happens when I get 2,000 subscribers? Basically, you do not need to pay for like an entire 2,000 subscribers all over again. We just pay for the difference between 1,000 subscribers and 2,000 subscribers. So yeah, that's why it's best to go for an annual plan and you can you know renew uh, and then you can upgrade based on your growth. So I also think it's a little cheaper to do that because you save more long term. All right, a question. So um, Alexi. First question for you would be this How one. Does you using... require okay. an additional subscription or send post to use the chatbot feature? Assuming I'm ready on a pro or standard plan. So if I'm mistaken, um, so if you use, uh, ad, so you need to pay for each service separately. So if, if you're on a pro like email marketing or maybe SMTP, in such a case, you need to um, uh, buy still uh, the chatbot plan or use our free version or trial. So bo both are both possible. And, but in any case, if you use like not chatbots, but other services, you need to pay or use free chatbot plan. Uh, with our free plan, you can create a chatbot and test the service. We, you are able to create a Telegram chatbot. You are able to create an Instagram chatbot. You are able to create a Facebook Messenger chatbot as well. You can apply for WhatsApp Business API solution, but you will be able to send like messages to 50 unique subscribers only. Um, and that's it. Uh, as Price mentioned, uh, you don't have to pay for a rich package, so for each plan, you don't have to pay the full price. You can upgrade whenever you want. So when you reach the number of subscribers, you can simply uh, select the plan, like the next plan, or maybe you'd want to um, buy like the biggest one 
and uh, click on buy, you will see the line. The system will show you the notifications. There will be a line like recalculation for unused funds. So the system and uh, it will be like a discount for the next um, uh, purchase for you. So yes. So let's All right. get back. Just to add to that question, um, if you're on the on any plan like your email marketing plan and you you, you want to go for the um, chatbot service, now like Alexi mentioned, for a single payment you have access to all chatbots. You know. A little difference with WhatsApp, but you have access to Instagram, Facebook, um, Telegram, and WhatsApp. So take advantage of that and you know grow your business on all of, all this platform, and then you will see that in a short time you can recover the investment as quickly as possible. Also, I always advise customers to always start like if you are start new with chatbot service, start with the, with the lowest plan, and then you can you know upgrade as your customer database grows. So the lowest plan is about twelve dollars. In Naira, it's about six thousand um, nine hundred Naira. Yeah. So, quick second question uh, is: This is it possible to add files, images, and um, video files? Yeah, of course it's possible. First of all, you can do that when you send manually, like uh, ordinary campaigns, updates. You can uh, attach files. You can include videos. Um, you can actually connect the links. So you can uh, redirect the person. You can create a button and connect it with uh, some other website. When the person clicks, the person will be redirected to that website. And uh, uh, so both are possible. So you can add it into like your message body. You can attach this, this file or you can redirect the person somewhere to watch it there. Also, customers can send you videos, they can send you images, they can send you files as well. So it's not different from the, what your normal Instagram. So there's no much difference there. All right, another question from Larry. Uh, can I turn off bot auto replies in case I need it? Uh, yeah, and uh, it also depends on, it also can be customized. You can, uh, um, it can be done in several ways. First of all, you can uh, turn off completely. You can uh, pause the flow. Let's say when you uh, started texting mm, in the the chat tab, something when you don't need that flow to keep sending messages, you can simply pause it, or it will be paused automatically. And um, so these are two options that can be done. And uh, one more thing, uh, you can also um, have, for instance, you have a chatbot with many flow with many flows. So some people prefer to build the huge one chatbots, so some prefer to build uh, many many flows, and uh, one flow can trigger another. So one flow can work like temporary from time to time when you need that. For instance, we used to have, or maybe we still have it in our St. Paul's blog, the case when we described like the chatbot for Facebook, uh, for, sorry, like for football team. And there was the, mm, the option, like the flow that was active during uh, those days uh, when the team played. And uh, it was inactive uh, when uh, it wasn't like the day when uh, you, you can uh, so like uh, there are the days it wasn't active uh, because it was a flow uh, like when you can you could buy a f food when you watch the football on the stadium you could buy food like order it and uh, order delivery uh, select the seat and uh, eat the food while watching football so this was like just that flow was temporary active just like once Per week one day per week for instance so it can be done as well okay um, so another question um just how about a creator account all right so basically let me um basically you need two accounts basically you need a private account and then you need a, your business account you can use a creator account you can use a business account the whole idea here is that you also need to have a facebook page that 
connect to that account. And the reason why you need a private account and also a business account or a creator account is that you need one account that you could use to run tests and one account you can use as like a owner of, to serve as a owner of the, you know, business account, all right? So yes, you can use that as well. And if you have questions, you can also reach out to Alexi and you can also reach out to me. I visit my email is uh, praiseascentor.com and um, um, Alexi's email is Alexi, let me just confirm it. Alexi, um, please mention your email. Okay. What, what sorry, what is your email? <laughs> All right, so we had other questions that, oh, um, why you, I think you're typing something. So I'll just mention this. We have other questions, so we get to, we may not be able to get to all of the questions, but we'll just do like two because of time. Um, Sent. So I, I want to add, like, um, I think that I will, uh, re like, repeat this thing each time when you invite me. Mm. So usually when uh, I watch webinars and I think there's many people who are watching this, they're watching it like mostly to be inspired. I don't know, like to have some ideas. But um, the thing is like uh, all of the, like all of you uh, knew about chatbots uh, that they exist uh, before you attend this webinar. And um, what usually happens after after you watch this video like <clears throat> usually uh, you start like okay like this is a great tool interesting ideas nice it, it, i need to have some time to find some time and uh, and after that i will uh, try it and maybe create it so and uh, it happens like uh, until you watch another webinar about instagram chatbot so don't hesitate now like this is why we're here like praise or myself i use our email um, yeah, you can email us whenever you want you can start a, a live chat with our technical support team you can if you are migrating for us from some other platforms so just let us know we will send you the guide how to migrate if you don't have any ideas but want to use it okay send us the list of your requirements maybe we'll suggest something on how somehow and give you some ideas to to start if you have some uh, problems with setting up an account so book a demo it's not a problem like there are many 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 ways how to get started how to set up an account so just do not wait until you next time will find information about instagram chatbot maybe it's like the salesperson i maybe i'm too salesperson that is why i keep repeating this but there are so many opportunities to reach us there are so uh, easy to test the service because we have a free trial we have a free plan so if you don't like it but i'm sure we will like it but uh, it's easier when you uh, have this opportunity to test and uh, the the like the layout is super user friendly you will uh, definitely feel that when you uh, spend like 15 minutes maybe half an hour you will see that this is like not uh, words that sales people use but this is really so you just need to try it so great, uh, great. yeah um <clears throat> like i mentioned at the beginning of the old training alexis is practically right it's very easy for you to you know learn something and then do not apply it and then you don't get the result and one thing we are trying to do in africa is to get results to help businesses get results so um i've dropped the link in the comment section go give it a try uh, it's pretty much easy to set up uh, so give it a try and you can actually try it out without for free so you don't need to pay up front but you need to pay to use the payment integrations uh you need to pay to use some other advanced tools but you can try it out for free test it out and see how easy it is to use also i dropped in the comment section our whatsapp line because i think some people don't you know find it con convenient to send emails so you may not want to type an email but you could send us a whatsapp message there's someone there to um to help you and um if you send an email by 2 a.m i just noticed from for some weird reason 
people like sending a lot of WhatsApp message by that time. So if you're sending a message by 2 a.m., a chatbot will respond to you, obviously. But we always make sure we respond to you within the working hours. Um, and even on weekends, so someone will also reach out to you on weekends as well. All right. Um, thank you so much, Alexi. Uh, we don't have much time for um, for more questions. So, but if you have a question, you can always reach us on us on WhatsApp. So many people have asked questions that we cannot address here. We already sending messages already on WhatsApp, and we've addressed the questions there. We will also try to make more content for question and question and answer that is very short. But what we want to achieve is that for people to watch this video to the end and not get to you know like there's a lot more videos to watch thank you so much alexi do you have any final thing to say uh, i think that this is it just if you know our like the topic for our next um, episode so you can announce it if still not so just uh, mm, want to tell that in one month we will come up with something more interesting even more interesting maybe it will be the second part of instagram chatbots or maybe something else maybe all meta platforms so but we will um, figure out what to tell you and we'll announce it soon. So thank yes. you for the time for thank the invitation. You so much. It was nice to thank talk to you guys. Yes, thank you so much, Alexi, for joining us today. Good to have you. And um, like Alexi mentioned, I do not want to spill the beans. Our next Daily Square series is going to be um, interesting. So we have a new we have new products coming up or new features coming up. We'll talk about that then. And before the um, before um, our next Village Square series, we are also going to have some other um, webinars before then. So look out for it and also always check your email. And we also try to, someone mentioned that we should try to send a WhatsApp update to keep people updated on WhatsApp. Like this is a new webinar coming up. We try to do that. Thanks for your suggestions. And then, um, do enjoy the rest of the day. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.